Hello and welcome to new tutorial in Autorisk Convener. Uh, in this tutorial, I will talking about this thing. What's this thing? This thing is uh, cylinder head for um, V12 engine. You see that we have many feature to do today than. I decide to divide these uh, this to several episodes. Let's uh, tell uh, five or six episodes. Then, uh, without talking much, let's start. Then uh, concentrate. Okay, I will. Uh, before that, I want to explain to you something. Uh, you see this? We have did many things in the in this component. If I activate this, uh, this I think. You see? Here. We add, um, I add, not we add, I add the, uh, the location of the water. The water is entered from here and here and uh, enter in this hole and go on and um, exit, exit exit or exit this cylinder head from here to go to the pump and make another cycle uh, I have another here okay we have any um, we haven't any interference between uh, between the inlet or the outlet here the gases uh, with the um, many holes here let's start I will close this no let's uh, start a new file standard here and click create mm. choose XZ plan Go to sketch. Um, the top, not the top, the top, the top. Okay, I found the top. Okay, see from the top, you have to see the top, um, like this. Start from um, a rectangle. Okay, put here one hundred forty-five. Then we have here. 1604 millimeter then use extrude extrude with uh, with what with 120 millimeter and go to more click here taper I think taper we can tell this in English put 8 degrees and click OK you have to see shaded with edges to see um, well then I have to add here from here you have to add the line one line like a reference to me to add uh, to add what to add the plan okay uh, go to dimension from here we have 36 millimeter and validate your sketch and go to plan click here and here now we have to add 
to put not to add to put um, an angle we have 168 an angle see from the front it's okay you have to see it like this no no not like this like this okay validate and uh, go to uh, this plan you created um, click sketch I have to rotate this okay like this is good okay you have to see your um, reference X axis like this and Z axis like this then click here and go to this feature I don't know what's the name of it then start from the line I have one line here can't see anything in inventor in inventor not in inventor in inventor then add the line here mm. how we can this and this okay then uh, i have to add some dimension to to explain to you what i did what i am doing not what i did i'm doing then from here to here we have 75 uh, from this side on this side this side not this from here we have 30 and from here, from yes, from here. No, not this. This one to this. But why? Oh, we can't add anything. Yes, from here, from this point or this. We have uh, eighty-seven. Okay. Hmm. I think we can add the mirror here. Let's see. This, and this. Oh, we can't. Okay. I have to add now uh, an arc from here to here. Add a relation between this and this one. The arc has 38.5. And the same thing in this side, you can convert this like uh, construction geometry, select this, go to mirror, click mirror line, apply, and done. I have just to add relation between this and this. And the work is done. Okay, it's fully defined, fully constrained here. Then... Uh, then 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 go 3d model extrude it select this area and click here cut cut it with uh, what you want 30 or more i think that's the result we have the result here you can hide this if you want to be in with visibility then uh, next step is select this face and add the circle here another here uh, without add another here because i will add the um, mirror select this and add dimension for this circle we have here 27 for this circle and from here we have 18 and from this one we have 14 then select it go to mirror select this line like a mirror and apply done and you can go to extrude 
the same thing is you cut with 2 millimeter and select this area I click OK now I have to add um, I have to add what the next step next step is to add um, exhaust system here let's see let's select this and add the circle here the dimension is um, 25 I think okay uh, then finish your sketch select here add the circle this circle has diameter of 45 the distance from here from from what from here from here from here we have 40 here then uh, then from from this point we have 87 I think you understand now this is is the middle it's in the middle of this one okay now you can write it to your sketch we have two sketches here you have to you have to have two sketches here now you can use left feature click in the left click cut here add one click here to add and select this one is the first the first sketch i click to add another click here and we have the result but not validate now we have another thing to do it's got a condition select here then choose direction condition we have 90 degrees here the same thing here brother it's the problem is done okay now the same thing you have to select this then project this i have to project it with this one and add another sketch here that's the same st step without talking you can understand me I think but I have to explain to you I think it's so hard to you but I think it's so easy by date go to left cute cute or cut cut I think it's cut not cute cute it's another mm, it's another word in English then I have to select this sketch how can I select it select other loop curve we have any sketch here for this I can the edge not the edge I want to click sketch 7 not this you can delete with uh, delete in your keyboard okay click and delete then now I want to select that but you want to select I don't know why I don't know why mm, it's not work like this I will do this one I will click here edit sketch this one I will convert like this and I will add the circle if anyone know how can I do this he can uh, explain to me how to do it I can't find the center. How oh, can I find the center?
Brick Links. Mm. Select this and geometry and click here and click Brick Links. Now you can click finish your sketch. Now I think you can go to left, cut here, and from here, the second is this one. The same thing we have in this here. I have to have sketch seven. Hmm, we can select it here. Then from here, the same thing too big now we have this result you have to see this result anyway you have to see this to verify this one is the center of this and from here you can verify your work from wireframe we have this result okay now we can uh, add um, f uh, not add it's to repeat this to repeat these uh, with mirror but I have I have to add the plan select this this plan and click here offset plan put here 72.5 click OK now you can select all of this go to mirror select this like a mirror and click OK now select all not the, not the work plan the mirror and all of these then go to repeat with a rectangular put here 6 and here 90 and click OK now you have this result and I will tell you see you next uh, no, not next week because you can't wait I think next episode I think it's um, it's time to go then uh, see you tutorial if you like you can uh, press like in the below if the of this video and uh, if you have any question don't hesitate to post it uh, share me videos thank you for watching see ya